have been curious about Vincent van Gogh all of my life. I remember visiting the Musée d'Orsay in Paris. I entered that room of Van Gogh's works. You've got this artist who left such an incredible legacy of work, and to me, that's got all the ingredients for a really interesting chart. When we had the idea of trying to fit all of Van Gogh's paintings, which is almost 900 in total, onto a single poster-sized chart, it was really exciting. But as we quickly discovered, there were a lot of challenges. This project has been three months in the making. To figure out how to fit the images onto a single poster-sized sheet, I had to map out a solution that would both be exciting for people to explore, but would also show the impact of what Van Gogh accomplished. One of the things I love about this project is there's some things even in this digital age that are still best done on big, beautiful sheets of paper. I've shown the prototype of this poster to people to get their input and it's been really fun to watch them lean in and explore the different categories. Instead of charting the paintings chronologically, I was more curious about what kinds of things Van Gogh chose to paint which kinds of objects or scenes were significant for his vision of the world. And that led to one of my epic Excel spreadsheets where I've got almost 900 paintings listed and I sorted them into groups, you know, like 38 self-portraits and 85 portraits of women, 44 portraits of men, and you know, how many wheat fields he did and which years he painted them, and then all the sunflowers, you know, and all the way through I'm noticing his early style compared to his later style, and there's landscapes and, and trees and towns and daylight and nighttime, and all of these insights started to come out, and I hope the people on Kickstarter will get a look at Van Gogh that's never been seen before, and I'm really excited to share this project with others.